Elsie, isn't it? Elise. Elise. Yeah. Elise, thank you for talking with us today. Day 14 of uh, the, the, the commissioning, and I think we might even be into development uh, period now. We've noticed some partitions in the cockpit. Are you allowed to let us know what they're for? Uh, yeah, I think you probably have to have a good study of your photos and videos that you've taken out there and see yep. what you can pick out. Right. <laughs> no, fair enough. Uh, today uh, was, it was a good day uh, breeze-wise. It was sort of around the, I guess, 14, 15 knot average, 18 in the peaks and maybe 12 in the, in the lulls. Yeah, 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 I think about a 13 knot average overall is sort of most breezy off Rangi Light. It was the wind and the tidal funneling through there, strongest wind, biggest waves. And then um, as we actually headed back to shore or as we headed out, it dropped off a little bit and um, sea state calmed down a bit also. Oh, so the, the boat looked to be uh, very in control today. Um, we did notice one or two bow stuffs um, on, on reaching or bearing away. Um, do we know if that's come from cavitation hitting something or is it just learning the controls? Uh, I think it's more just practice and the guys are trying lots of different things to really figure out the fastest way to sail the boats, most efficient ways to get through manoeuvres. Um, yeah, just trying to push the boat more and also a bit of uh, looking for some top speeds and some of those bear ways for a bit of fun. But if I know, it certainly looked rapid, <laughs> rapid. Uh, yeah, we uh, noticed that the tacking seems to be getting slicker and we, we seem to come out of the tack almost with a little bit of leeward heel and then pretty, within a, in a second or two, the windward heel comes on and the boat accelerates, almost like a roll tack. Is, is that something where the boys are actively trying? Yeah, I think it's really trying to have that minimum time with two fours in the water. It's all a game of wetted area, so um, when you've got two fours in the water and that plus the rudder, if you get rid of one four, that's quite a lot less. So just get the foil out of there and not leave it in too long. Okay, that makes sense, timing, yeah. Um, and we were on the, the J3 all day today, uh, probably a little bit downrange, or are we happy with that, with um, that, that lower stuff? I think we're stuff? pretty happy with it, it's mm. going quite well through the range, um, and definitely wanting it in those scuffs. Yeah, yeah, no, you yeah. can see the side loading when the, when the, when the puff comes on, how um, the boat does sort of stand up from, yeah, the, yeah and uh, yeah. Um, we had no issues with sea state today. It wouldn't have been as big as yesterday, so... No, no, it didn't get quite as bad as yesterday, but we were looking for that sea state, you know, thinking about, you know, conditions in Barcelona and, yeah, there's that going around that rangy light area to keep testing it a bit more ways when we can. Nice. Thank you very much. No 